You know, military veterans, they've served. You know, they've been in situations where they had to make decisions in ambiguity. They've understood what it means to take off everything you've done up to that point and show up as a new person on boot camp with the same shoes and the same uniform as the next person. They understood what it meant to make a commitment to the person to your left and right and in front of you and behind you. I had the opportunity to serve in a platoon that was incredibly diverse, everything from a Choctaw Indian to immigrants to the, you know, the son of you know, Southeast Asian refugees. And just understanding their version of America, their perspective on life, I believe has made me a more understanding, and caring, and compassionate American who can look at you know, the experiences of other people across the country uh, from all backgrounds with empathy. And I think that's one of the things that's really critical today. When you take off the uniform after you leave the military, you take something else with it, right? Having Team Rubicon lets them come in, actually serve and help a community that absolutely needs it, but it also maintains that brotherhood and sisterhood, that camaraderie. Service comes up, rank almost never does. And at the end of the day, you've done something guaranteed positive for somebody that day. You know, putting on a vest, putting on a hard hat, picking up a chainsaw, uh, getting behind a piece of heavy equipment, having a sledgehammer in my hand, just getting out and actually feeling the impact, you know, through your, through your efforts and through your work. You build sisterhood and brotherhood through common pain and suffering, and disasters are a common pain and suffering. Those walls go away and you just see a neighbor that's struggling, and I think it's a very American ideology to volunteer to help your neighbor. Veterans Day for the organization is always a time for us to reflect on that heritage, to thank those uh, within the organization who have served, and to really draw forward that spirit of selflessness and service that they demonstrated while in uniform, that they continue to demonstrate wearing the gray shirt in Team Rubicon.